ever wanted to live in Japan for just one month or even a couple of years? Renting apartments in Japan can be a bit tricky for foreigners as it requires a lot of paperwork, a real estate agency, security deposit, key money, and more. Generally, to find an apartment in Japan, first you need to visit a real estate agency. Tell them your preferences for your ideal apartment, such as location, type of room, toilet bath layouts, gas electricity options, directions of the balcony or window, etc. Then they'll find available rooms and print out the contract details along with the room layout. Once you've decided the apartment to live in, the next step involves lots of paperwork. These are the things you need to have. Bank account information, a pay slip, a guarantor's signature and seal, and a certificate of the guarantor's seal. And here are the costs you'll need to take care of for your first payment. Security deposit, an appreciation fee for the apartment owner, commission for the real estate agent, fire insurance, average rent of the month you move in plus the following month's rent, and if you don't have a guarantor, a fee for a guarantor company. Japan has a guarantor system meaning foreigners renting an apartment must have a Japanese citizen co-sign the apartment contract. A guarantor, or co-signer, is a person that acts as the insurance for your rental contract. They promise to cover any rent or damage costs if you can't pay or suddenly leave the country. This is a step that's quite unique to renting an apartment in Japan. However, there are some apartments that don't require you to pay a guarantor fee, appreciation money, or commission to the real estate agent. This allows you to save a lot of money and skip tedious paperwork. Apartment Japan is a website where you can search for places like these and actually book an apartment before you even come to Japan. To rent an apartment, all you need is a passport, visa, and credit card. Just like booking a hotel, the entire process can be completed online. And all listings can be viewed in English. Check out each apartment's atmosphere, the room plan, and exact location on a map. After reviewing the rental conditions and optional services, you can get a quote and fill out an application. Once you have decided on a place, you can review the lease agreement terms and submit a digital signature online. Unlike accommodation sharing websites, renting an apartment is a formal lease agreement so you can use your apartment's address to issue a visa or open a bank account. This is convenient for those who come to Japan for short-term study abroad or even long-term residents. You can then make a reservation for a face-to-face -face meeting to sign the printed contract and have your key handed to you in person. The staff at Apartment Japan are willing to help you. Feel free to consult with them about any questions you may have about your new place such as rules for taking out the garbage or recycling.